Hi guys, so today's review is on the Mission Samurai 2 board. I did ask a couple of weeks ago what board to get next because I had the Windmore Blade 5 and I decided I want to try something different. And a lot of yous came back about the Mission Samurai 2 board, so I ordered this off a dark corner and I eventually got it up. And I also ordered some wedges to go with it, so I've got the Mission wedges here. Um, you got a bunch of these, so I've got them in the back. It's pretty solid up. So what we'll do is we'll have a look at the board closer. Uh, I'll do the top half and then the second half of the board. Then after that we'll have a few throws at the board and see what it's like after. Throw some darts at it and see how well it blends in. And we'll see if this has a lot of issues like the one more Blade 5 does with the bounce outs. Um, so hopefully I can hit that. But let's have a closer look at the board now. Okay, so I'm going to closer look at the top half first. You can see it's got a nice black shade colour to it. This, to me, I would say is more of a matte colour to it. It's not a black black, but it's like a, a greyish black tone to it, which is really nice. Also, what I noticed about the, the Mission logo here, it's actually painted onto the web itself. I'll show you a closer look at that then now. So as you can see, it's got the paint going over the, the web itself, so it blends into the, the Mission logo, which is absolutely fantastic. That's a nice little key point. Again, just having a closer look, I've noticed there's a few bleed marks uh, in the 5, 1 and the 4 in the treble areas. So just again, I'll just show you it right there. There's just a little bleed, uh, just bleed right through. Nothing major, it's not a, a huge big deal. Um, I wouldn't really pay attention to that at all. Another thing I did notice, there is a little indent just up here. There's a little hole. But again, it's that small. Um, you don't really notice it at all. A close look at the bull area. Nice green colour. No bleed through into the bull's area. And the bull's not bleed through into the 25 area, which is quite good. So I'll do it like that. Looking at the bottom half of the board, again I've noticed a little gap here, a slight hole but it's not um, going to make any difference at all in my opinion, but there is a, a slight hole there. Um, the rest of the paint on the bottom half looks really good, there's no bleed throughs that I can see. Uh, good colour, again the Samurai logo, they, they painted over the, the webbing so it the, the wording is over the metal part as well, so it doesn't split it, which is really nice. There's a good touch to it. It's definitely a nice looking board. I do like the, the matte black grey finish on it. I do like the, the paint blending into the, the web itself, so it doesn't split the, the logo up, which is good. Yes, there is a couple of little bleed points, but it's not a major issue. Yeah, so let's go chuck some darts and see how well the board manage. Okay, so we'll have a few throws at the board. Um, it's just it's not about how well I can throw a dart, it's about how well this board can handle my darts. So I'll just throw at random areas, go for the bull a couple of times as well. If I can hit the bull, I see if it bounces out. Um, I know sometimes the bull can be so hard compressed that it just will not let a dart in. So We'll have a few throws, see how we get on. Haven't thrown at the board yet, there's no marks on it from any darts yet. So this is the first time it's gonna have a dart in the board. So here we go. My first throw in darts as well. Hey, 66, no bad for the first throw. But it's very quiet. I think the with the wedges in the back, it's it's not made that echo noise. It's not as loud as the the one more board was. But again, the one more has taken a bit of a beating. But it's very quiet so far. Keep getting it with the last start. Just having a quick look. Not bad. 
normally it's a dump, dump, uh, with my last board because I wouldn't, I can't play it late at night because of my neighbours obviously. But this, I feel comfortable. I could play it late at night. It won't affect my neighbours. It's not impacting too hard. Nice and quiet, I like it. That's a good sign. Right, I'm gonna go for the bull or attempt to bull. <laughs> a mile off. Oh, I've got a 25. Again, aiming at that centre piece, it's not loud as well, so that's good. I need to move this out of the way, keep having to adjust. Oh, I've locked myself. Hmm. No, blocked myself. A couple of indents just looking back up where I've hit you don't really see where the, the darts have been in so it just slowly starts to close ah oh, there's one in overshot I've got one in and it stayed in so I'm going to push that in see what it's like it is quite firm, but it does let the dart in. I mean, just pushing that in, it's, it's not overly hard to push in. I just see a couple of dots there where I've marked it, but yeah, it's nice and soft going in. Definitely the bonus point for me is that how quiet it is. Wrong bed. Too low. treble one king I do see the, the bleed out mainly on that treble one just standing here looking at uh, it does look a bit messy at the treble one but the rest of it looks fantastic I um, don't see any real issues standing here I do see that on the 19 that little um, hole which could be a bit of a distraction here See if we can aim for it. Oh, thought that was nowhere near it. My cat is trying to lick the laptop. Oh, missed it. Well off. Get distracted with the cat. There is no edit in this one. I'm just going for it. <laughs> Each I think I'm editing. I'm not. I'm just trying to be as real as with this board as possible. And I haven't thrown darts all week. I 
I'm just throwing randomly at the board and just try to hear it as well. Oh, I'm a mile off here. But I do like the, the matte tone on that. You know, it's not black black, it's like a greyish black. Nice matte finish to it. As my cat is trying to go onto the laptop. Hey, stop it. Right, I'll do a couple more. I just want to see how it held up. Right, I'll leave it at that. Let's have a closer look at the board. Okay, having a closer look at the board, you can see on the, the Big 20 where I've been hitting it, or I pushed in some of the darts. Um, doesn't seem to affect it really at all. Again, you can see at the 20 areas, you, you hardly notice where I've hit it, and that and the fact I didn't really hit it much. More of a treble one kind of guy. Um, looking at the bull, you can see where I've hit the 25s. I did hit it once in the bull. Um, it did go in quite easily. It didn't bounce out at all, which was really nice. That little indent here um, was a bit of an eye candy. But again, it's not really impacted on the, the board that much. So again, for me, it would have to be the... The only part you can't really see it because the light, so I'll switch this off the light. Uh, if you look at the treble one area, it does bleed out a little bit, and when I'm standing back, uh, I do actually see quite a lot of the green on the white. And again, looking at the the treble five and the double five, you can see it much clearer in this kind of light. But again, it, I didn't really see that much when I was st uh, standing back at the OK line. For the fives, the one was kind of a, a bit of a let down, but again, it's not going to make that much uh, difference to your performance and your darts. So the Mission Samurai 2 board, uh, I do like the board. There is, yes, some quality issues with it, with the bleed through and a couple of little holes in it, but again, they're making thousands of these boards. That is going to get one or two pit through quality, past the quality, and just missed out but again it's such a fantastic quality board apart from that uh, the bonus side for me was this the impact on it there was very little noise very little thud coming from it so I know with this being on the wall that's attached to my neighbor uh, they're gonna hear this very little uh, so that's a bonus and I think the mission wedges helped with that as well so if you're getting this board do look at getting wedges as well uh, they cost like a fiver and I think you get eight in the pack, so it's worth having as well. But all in all, this is an absolutely fantastic board. If you're looking for something a little bit different from Winmore and slightly cheaper, uh, again, this is just over £30, so it's like £33 or something like that. Um, definitely look at the Mission Samurai 2 board. Absolutely fantastic board. And it is definitely one to think about having as your next purchase. So that's it from me guys. Hope you liked the video. Don't forget, click that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Turn on your notifications for any new reviews and live streams. And I'll catch you in the next one. Happy darting guys. Bye.